Hello, welcome to Anson Griffith's occasional series of YouTube tutorials. Today we'll be looking at events and in particular mouse events for Visual Basic 2010. And uh, just to say that this example it's not my own, I took it from the website highlighted here, tutorials point. Uh, these are some of the mouse events. So when you go into a text box, you know, mouse down, mouse enter, mouse hover, mouse leave, etc. So you're saying I don't quite get this but we're going to do a simple example uh, there are some other things we can do you can get the position uh, the X and Y position of where you clicked this might be useful in games or selecting a particular area on screen so we have an example set up we have a form just flick back here we have three labels and we change the text property to three labels to customer ID, name and address. So there so we are. And so down here in the bottom right, we change the text to customer ID. We change the text there to name. And for this label here, we change the text to address. For this uh, text box, that's where I'm pointing to here text ID text name and for this text box here I put in text address and for this button here I changed the text to submit okay so we've done all of that and then there's a an awful long piece of code and you're saying I you know, do have to type this in, this is impossible but fortunately life is very easy so say for instance here we want to do something here so we double click here so that comes up and well, we don't want text change here if we just go up here and we want a mouse enter so it pops up there I had it done already I'm just going to take that out so if you're doing it for the first time that's what you'll see and then you want to put in you know what happens so if I just do a control V here so remember single apostrophe <coughs> is the code for handling mouse enter and ID so on mouse enter text ID dot back color so the text ID is the name of the text box and the back color will change to color dot blue, and the four color is color dot white. Down here, I have this done already. When I leave, the text ID back color is color dot white, and the foreground is color dot blue. So you would do the same for the you. Know, I'm not going to type you know, copy and paste all in the whole code, but that's what you see. Let's run this piece of code. Simple example. So on mouse enter, okay, customer ID is one, two, three. Customer name is Anselm. Mouse enter again, address is Bolton Street. Submit. And just to go back to your here, just to put back to there, just in case I was going too fast. So we have the code, and there for the command for the button, message box, thank you, ampersand, text name dot text. So it'll take the name that you entered for the text box called text name, and then for your kind cooperation. Okay. Now, just in case I went too quickly. Uh, no to all for the second so I'll just go slowly through the code here okay and I'll just take that out that shouldn't be there okay so very short intro, hope that helps. I'll revisit this one now in the, in the next tutorial. Thanks very much for listening.